Oh, how I love to hate these old game show games. This is win, lose, or draw. And doesn't this title screen just inspire, like, so much hope that this game's gonna be good? Like, three bored, soon-to-be-divorced couples sitting in front of a fireplace. Also, how about this for a title screen? Just, like, slightly off-gray with text coming at you so fast you can't possibly even read it. And I'm gonna skip the demonstration here, because I don't want to spoil how awesome the game actually is. So let's press start to begin. And essentially, if you like Pictionary, but decided that the Pictionary game was not for you because it wasn't Pictionary at all, then this game is probably right up your alley. So we're gonna be Team 1, Women, Team 2, Nobody, because we basically just want this to be us only playing, otherwise it's impossible, I need a second controller. The level has to go up to difficult, otherwise it's insultingly easy. And you can see drawing mode here. We can either draw ourselves or have the computer draw it for us. I would much rather have the computer draw it for us, because otherwise this shit would be fucking impossible. Anyway, let's get started here. So you can see I'm playing as these, like, conjoined, buxom twins over here. And essentially, this is just Pictionary, where they will give us a category, and then the computer will draw it, and we'll have to guess what it is. And on easy, it's so fucking easy. Like, I've had, like, a sad triangle, and considering they give you 60 seconds, then the shit is fucking it's so goddamn easy. Okay, but sometimes you get in a situation like this, where it's almost too hard, and, uh... You know, I'd say I have about a 50% batting average on difficult, so hopefully we'll see a mix of both good and difficult here. Let's see, is this a camera? That's what I'm gonna guess. Oh, it's a something camera. Okay, maybe it's a TV camera. Or a movie camera. Oh, game pause. Maybe movie camera. Hmm. I've never played as the girls before. I hope they have the same kind of knowledge. Oh, shit. Um... Um... On camera? And you can see, every time I answer, my points are going down a little bit. As this music just plays back and forth in my head like a polka composed by Beelzebub himself. What is this? A, a TV... A flash camera? Movie camera? Video... Video! It's probably video camera! There's no time! Goddamn on-screen keyboard! Candid camera? How is that candid camera? And they're all like Darth Vader in uh, Revenge of the Sith. No! Get over it. Let's put it this way, it's win, lose, or draw. And considering there's no other team playing against you, I'm pretty sure the worst you're gonna do is draw. Oh, I just got it! Win, lose, or draw. But it's kind of more like, uh, you know, Alien vs. Predator. Whoever wins, we lose. And draw, I suppose. This has got to be handshake, right? You better not be drawing a penis there. Win, lose, or draw. This is a family-friendly game show. Hand... Hand off? What is... What is he holding? Is he holding, like, a, a sleeve of saltine crackers? Hand off? Hand... Washing? I... I honestly don't... Is, is he holding a washcloth? This is absurd. It's gotta be washing. I had one one time that I looked at it for, like... Well, I guess the whole minute. I had no idea what it was... Oh, God. I had no idea what it was supposed to be. It was like a scar next to... Oh, you know what? It's probably hand towel! Uh-oh. I think I might actually have this. I gotta put my story on hold. Maybe it's hand cloth? Oh, come on. I didn't have time. One hand washes the other?! So much for my 50% batting average. Oh, uh, yeah, it was similar to this one, where it was like a scar, and then beside it, it had a clock, and I was like, I have no fucking idea. And it was a stitch in time. Alright, let's pay attention here. Body language. Body language. Okay. Like, for instance, the body language on my players right now shows that they're not that interested. Okay, this has to be heart on the sleeve, right? Heart on my sleeve. So it's, like, it's similar to the Family Feud games for, like, this era of games. Where you don't know what's, like, what's gonna actually trigger the game. Heart, obviously. On. Sleeve. Okay, I've got all the keywords. This should be enough. Okay, that is enough. Excellent. I'll give the game's programmer some credit. Now watch how these people celebrate. Like, Harry? Harry? Was that ever, like, slang for something being good? And then they just covered their mouths over and over, like, they were actually ashamed that it's Harry. So if you're looking for any kind of variety in this game, you are going to be sorely disappointed. It is essentially the exact same thing over and over. Okay, potluck here. Something these two girls are probably good at, am I right? <laughs> uh, you know, sometimes my jokes are sexist, but you lovely bitches in Hoshino, know I'm trying to correct this. Um... Pancake face? 
What is this? Is this cookie dough? Is it a mask? Is it sad? It was just sad? That was it? It was Harry again. No, it's not Harry, it's sad. Oh my god. Okay, so I had one hand washes the other, and then the next time I had sad. That's what I mean when I say it's either ridiculously easy or almost impossibly hard. Alright, couch potatoes. I don't even know what that means. It's gonna draw a picture of Chris Farley. To, to its credit, the computer is mostly a good drawer. I'll give it credit for that. For a good artist. Okay, these would be mountains. And that would be a road. Uh, and that would be... Okay, so this should be like... Is that a man's face? Get on... Look! <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna say, I gotta at least put mountain. Maybe that'll give me somewhere to start. Okay, mountain Road, Hill Road, Hill Street Blues? Am I the smartest man on Earth? Hill? Oh my god. This is showing both how dated the game is and how dated I am. Hill Street... Blues. I can't believe this is actually it. I'm, I'm ashamed. I'm a little impressed with myself, I'm not gonna lie, but I'm also ashamed. That's amazing. <laughs> that was way better than I thought of. Yo, nipple Street Sad. Neat! <laughs> Let's just stand up for no reason. I think after the next clue, or maybe one more... Oh, no, right now we're gonna go to the speed round, which is where everything comes together. Exactly the same thing, and not even faster. But I guess, you know... Since when does a speed round have to have any semblance of speed at all? So basically now the computer is just going to draw fast and we're going to do, uh, you know, no breaks, no neat, no hairy. Okay, what is this? This is a road. I can do that. This is right in my wheelhouse. Pun intended. Oh, shit. Streets? Highway? Okay, okay, I'm lucky. I'm lucky that the streak was it, otherwise I would have just been hanging out on that for the next 45 seconds. Okay, those are pants. I've worn those before, or at least I've heard of them. Oh, panks? I gave up panking when the internet thought it was cool. This is what I mean. Who is not going to get pants in a game of Pictionary? How pissed would you be if you lost the game because you got pants and somebody else got, like, you know, a stitch in time. One hand washes the other. Or Hill Street Blues. Oh, that was, sorry, just ball. My bad. I would have drawn something else for that one if you catch my drift. What is this? Is this a wrench? Can you draw it a little bit faster? Oh, it's an airplane. Not not so much a wrench. What were they calling them back in the 90s? Airplanes or jets? Just planes? I always called them, you know, flying death traps. Air planets? Oh, it'll take it. All right, now I've got three seconds, which means I might as well just fucking give up because of this on-screen keyboard. What is that, a toilet? <laughs> Close enough. Oh, that was super rad. You can tell definitely that this game was made in the late 80s. Alright, so we won! Let's just do the hustle right now! And then this game plays this fucking, like, again, the, the polka from hell over and over. I'm trying to skip it, but I guess the game wants to give you time so you can write down the G-M-Y-U-E-H-Z. Just in case you wanted to play this exact section of game again, I guess. Or start, o start over with a score of 377. So I really don't know what they were thinking with this game. I guess... Who, who even watched Win, Lose, or Draw? Was that a children's show? You can't really take advantage of the children with this one if it's not. But, in any case, this has been another Let's Hate. As always, please leave a suggestion in the comments for games that you would like to see Let's Hate it. And I'll take some time, play them up, and you know, do the ones that are appropriate. As always, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you next time. Ah, oh, this song is going to loop on and on for the rest of my entire life, which I am soon to take. Jesus Christ, come on!